Hi guys, thank you so much for clicking on the video. Today I'm going to share with you the most gorgeous French onion soup. Uh, a couple months ago I really wanted to try French onion soup, but I was very nervous because that's so French and I'm so not French. But I gave it a shot and it came out so beautifully and so I've been hooked on the recipe and now since I have mastered the perfect French onion soup, I decided that it was time I want to share it with you. So let's get started. French onion soup is actually super super easy to make. So I'm going to start with some yellow onions and the reason we use yellow onions is because it has a little bit of sweetness and it helps caramelize faster. Now onto the pot, I'm going to turn on the stove and now into that goes in 2 tablespoons of butter and about 2 tablespoons of olive oil. I love that sizzling sound. And we're going to drop in our sliced onions. This will take a good 5 to 6 minutes before we can add in salt and sugar. You add in a pinch of salt and then we're going to add in a teaspoon of sugar. And I'm going to turn the flame to medium to low and let this slow cook and slowly caramelize and develop that beautiful, gorgeous brown color. This is after 20 minutes. And I'm gonna let this go for about 15 more minutes. Fair enough, this is looking really, really beautiful. Now to thicken up a little bit um, of the French onion soup, I'm going to add in a couple tablespoons of flour. And just stir it on a low flame. So now into this, it's time to add in the liquid. And for the liquid, we're using beef broth. And it just goes straight in the pan. Just give it a good stir. At this point, I'm gonna add in a few bay leaves. A quick simmer before I pop a lid over this for about 10 to 15 minutes. French onion soup is simmering and finishing up. I am going to work on how we're gonna serve this. And traditionally, French onion soup is served with a baguette that's topped with gruyere cheese that's melting. I'm just gonna slice it diagonally. Just like so. Alright, it was super duper hot. It's gonna take me a while. Oh my gosh. Yes. This is a little bit of goo rare cheese, give it that pungent flavor. This is perfect for this time of year. It's gloomy outside, it's overcast, and all you wanna do is just take this sit on your couch and watch some Christmas movies. Even though Christmas has passed. But this is just plain perfect. Keeps you warm. I hope you guys like this video. If you guys try this and like my video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thanks for hanging out with me. Time out. <laughs>